I'm going to try and make this video short and sweet, but this is a Philips speaker. It is out of a Philips computer speaker system, and it is 4 ohms. It's in very good condition, no foam rod or anything, but I have nothing to do with it, so I'm just going to blow it up anyways for the sake of YouTube. So, of course, we're going to have it in alternating current. I'm prepared to see what happens. Let's see what happens. And a one, a two, skiddly diddly do. Whoa, that was a nice reaction. And I think we've already killed it. Oh, yes, this thing is already gone. Look at that. The whole cone just went down inside. She's done for. I think it busted the wires. Yeah. Let's go ahead and take this thing apart. I don't think the camera got it very good, but it was very loud when it popped. So let's just go ahead and cut that foam there. Good. I like that sound. And there's the voice call. It's still hot, which is a bit weird because it doesn't look like it blew up. Like it doesn't look like it has any damage. But you never know. I bet you what happened is the breaker went out again whenever I. Uh, plugged it in. Our house has very sensitive breakers and just the slightest little thing will make it trip. I really need like a rectifier so I won't have a short circuit. Yeah there's the voice call and even if I tried to plug it in again it probably wouldn't work anymore so that was just a short little video and I'll see you guys later.